Oh my God, thank you very much. And let me tell you something, all these people that don't think this is real, I thought the same thing, that I'd never win, I'd never win, don't give up. So is it real? Oh my God, yeah, it's, it's real. <laughs> What is going on guys? It is freezing out. We are in Rhode Island and uh, we already got the truck warming up. Oh my God, it's 30 degrees. I'm not gonna be able to do this for very long. Uh, we're gonna go pick up the trailer. We got the Turbo Bullet. We're gonna be bringing this to Rick, the Bullet winner. I'm very excited to finally get it over there. Um, we announced the winner probably a little bit less than a month ago. Uh, but it did take a little bit of time to free up my schedule so I could come up here and deliver it. Uh, and luckily, it was actually close to uh, where we grew up um, in Rhode Island, so that's why we are here in Rhode Island. And uh, we arranged today to bring it over to Rick. Um, let's get in the truck, it's freezing. But um, I've had the truck running for a little bit. Um, it's like 30 degrees out, it's freezing. So let's go grab the trailer, um, probably grab some coffee, and head over to see Rick. I know he is super excited, he's very, very, happy to have won the bullet. So, let's head over. 26 degrees. That is cold. So, I actually unloaded the bullet once I got here and I had to swap coolant into it um, because in Florida we run uh, distilled water, especially in some sort of race car. Um, it is the by far easier route and especially if you're taking a car on track, if you ever have a leak, water is much better. However, up here, water freezes. So we had to put some coolant in it for Rick. Uh, so I did go ahead and get that done, pull it out of the trailer, got that swapped over, and it should be ready for him. So I'm really uh, excited to see what he thinks, and uh, I really hope he uh, enjoys this car for a very long time. So we are about 40 minutes out from Rick. Um, I do want this video to be a lot of uh, fun and uh, really, uh, really happy video. Uh, I do want to just make some announcements on the giveaway. Um, there are a few orders that are still pending uh, fulfillment. We have been waiting for our gray uh, t-shirt order. Um, as you know, everything pretty much in any industry, um, things are out of stock and the supply is very low and the demand is very high. Um, we've been waiting to get those gray shirts, not just printed, but the t-shirt printer has been waiting to get those back. Um, this giveaway was actually significantly more stressful than the last one, uh, just with everything going on, building the car and everything. Um, overall, I'm really, really glad. It seems like Rick is a really good person. It seems like he's going to really enjoy it. Uh, so that brings me great joy. Um, the stress of the giveaway and everything going on um, really just took a toll on me and uh, over the past few months. So I don't really know when we're going to be doing another giveaway, if we are going to do another one. Um, obviously, uh, Rick is very happy uh, with uh, the car and uh, the previous uh, giveaway winner uh, with the Wibble S550. Um, they are definitely happy with it. Um, but dealing with a lot of the people being very mad or waiting a long period of time for orders or being upset that they didn't win a car, um, that stuff is just not really that much fun. Um, so we're definitely going to kind of recalculate uh, things as we go forward. Um, definitely not doing another like car build during a giveaway. Um, it was extremely expensive to get this car uh, back to a, a place where it it was you know safe good reliable um, so that took an immense amount of money much more than I would have originally thought and took up a lot of my time which was really really a big struggle uh, with everything I got going on but like I said I want this video to be happy uh, I want to go ahead and uh, show up uh, give the car to Rick and see a big smile on his face so let's go ahead and continue on over there that's just the announcement I wanted to make uh, we will be doing probably a sale 
sale on all the remaining uh, t-shirts and uh, everything else. We are actually moving soon too, so if we have to move less stuff, uh, that would be um, much better. Uh, so what we're gonna do is once all the orders are filled, we are going to go ahead and run a sale with live inventories. Basically when things sell out, they sell out, and then uh, we'll kind of reassess the situation and uh, see what merchandise we want to reorder in the future and what we want to make for new designs. So that way we can kind of start fresh with merchandise and uh, kind of separate the merchandise from the giveaways um, for a little bit. All right, so we're here in Connecticut. It's a little bit cold this morning. A little. <laughs> but uh, this is Rick. Um, I called him up, what, three weeks ago or so? About three weeks. Yep, and uh, pretty sure he's ready to see what's inside ah. here. I don't think he can wait. So, Turbo Bullet. Gonna be up in Connecticut now. Yeah, you're up in the Arctic. Whoa. Yeah, it was like 20 something degrees this morning. I had to swap out for uh, coolant in this thing. Mm. Yeah, you can't run water up here. No. Get away with it in the summertime. In Connecticut, you have two, uh, two seasons. Winter yeah. and not winter. <laughs> All right. There she is. I will say she's not perfect, but. Perfect enough for me. <laughs> She does uh, run pretty good. I spent a lot of time trying to figure out, you know, all the little flaws with the new setup. So, and it makes... What happens when you go from a Mustang motor to a Lincoln motor, don't you? Yeah, well this one, uh, th I think this one's a Crown Vic. Um, so, yeah, I mean, they're pretty much identical um, besides the oil pan, which, as you know, I uh, messed up the first time. But, yeah, here she is. We went through uh, radiator fans. Um, they uh, they blew the radiator fan, so I put a slim fan in it. That's what we did in Mustang Week, Myrtle Beach. But yeah, I'm just gonna get this uh, pulled out of here. There we go. <laughs> So is it real? Oh my god, yeah, it's, it's real. <laughs> oh my god. I told him, this is my car. Uh-oh. <laughs> Got the resident YouTuber right here. Yeah, I'm a bottom of the barrel channel right now. <laughs> I'm going to 
drive it, it's mine. There you go. It does not like this cold, man. It is very cold. Yeah, yeah. all that I have left of my Mustang, the one that got smashed, the horse. They found the horse up by the telephone pole. Oh, yeah. Oh yeah, it's it's gonna be a lot of fun. I mean up here this is this is fast. I mean the horsepower in today's world, people look at it like oh it's only like 470, 480 wheel, but it's it's fast. I mean I went tens with low 400 wheel in this car and uh, it's not very different from then. You know, it's got the back seats in and passenger seat. And uh, other than that, in a drag pack, uh, it's the only difference, but now it makes even more power. Let me say bye to this thing. It's been good. And I think Rick will really enjoy it. He's got that Florida jacket on. Yeah. Ready for some warmer weather. Can't wait. February. He'll be down. He'll be down. Big tour in February. Can't wait. This clutch is heavy. Yeah, the clutch is heavy. Um, but this is the same clutch that I was able to do the uh, 10 second passes with. Should be a lot of fun for you to enjoy with your son. Oh yeah. <laughs> on drag radials but it's cold it's really cold so it'll definitely spin oh, will it now? yeah in Florida these hook up pretty good on the warm roads the shirt that won. Oh I yeah. the hat and I bought the keys. Well you got another one too. Tag. But I also bought a couple of shirts before originally when I first when you first started this giveaway. Yeah. And then at the end I was like you know what I'm gonna buy one more shirt. Yes I know it's the same shirt I bought already but I'm gonna buy one more shirt. Yeah. And that's the shirt that won. 
And I have that shirt on. Oh yeah. <laughs> it's just too cold right now to have it out. I just bought another, I bought a, a hoodie from you guys because it's getting cold. I got hoodies from everybody else. I just didn't want to wear them. That's why I wore the Florida shirt. The yep. jacket, the light jacket. So, is it real? Oh, it's real now, thank God. Oh my God! <laughs> now for a twist, he's taking it back to Florida with them. Oh! <laughs> no, no, I got too many cars. <laughs> Here she is. I think you guys are gonna enjoy it. So you said you had a YouTube channel? Yeah, legit underscore boss. All right, you're gonna be making videos on this thing? Car and my regular contact games and everything. Nice. Well, I'm excited to see what you guys do with it. I think you guys will enjoy it. I will. <laughs> there you go. Once I learn how to drive it. Yeah, it's you gotta be careful, it's a fast car. I mean, 400 and 70 horsepower in this car is quite a bit. So I'm really excited to see what you guys do with it. And uh, I'm gonna be saying bye to the old turbo bullet. Out here in the cold Connecticut. how cold it is <laughs> oh yeah like 40 degrees it's too cold for me it's too cold for all of us <laughs> <laughs> yeah so you can yeah, put training wheels on it for you <laughs> you need to boost your seat you can't even reach the pedal <laughs> well you adjust the seat that's right yeah the buttons in the front Yeah, it's something that you know you guys can work on it together and enjoy it. It doesn't need anything uh, major. You know, it's ready to to run and drive. I just wish it wasn't so cold up here to have fun with the car. You know. Oh yeah, it's, you, it's you gotta be careful on uh, it. It's on some street tires, but they are drag radials. So when it's cold. Oh, oh, this car. Well, the apartment we're gonna look at has a garage. That there you I'll, go. I'll be renting the garage to put the car in. So, so it's not gonna be sitting outside in the yep. cold. All right, Mr. Rick, I think that's a done deal. Oh my God, thank you very much. And let me tell you something, all these people that don't think this is real, I thought the same thing, that I'd never win. I'd never win, don't give up. Dude, when you give up, it's when you don't win. Keep going, you finally get, you'll finally get it. That's it. Um, so you got a turbo bullet to uh, terrorize the streets around here. Oh, with. and I will. Cops yeah. are not going to like me around here, I'll tell you that. <laughs> so I really hope you enjoy the car. We'll keep in touch. Um, like I said, uh, your son's YouTube channel. Uh, you guys are going to film some videos. Also, the car is not perfect. You know, uh, there's some tweaks to do here and there. Um, mechanically, runs, drives great, tune-ups great. It's got AC, it's got fan, it won't overheat. Um, there's some cosmetic things and some minor things to do. But uh, I think we pretty much went over, pretty much went over everything. We uh, spent, I don't know, half an hour going over, making sure he knew where the wiring was and basically everything to service the car if he ever has to service it. I owned it. The car's not gonna be anything but a warm weather car. That is not gonna be, especially up here, it gets cold. Yeah, with this cold, early. I mean, it, it'll spin really bad uh, on by drag radials. By so. September, the car will be parked because the car, it gets too cold up here from that. But uh, unless I switch the tires over, then I'll have some fun with the cold weather. <laughs> and then around April is when we'll be bringing it out again, right? Yeah. So the videos for the car probably won't be coming out till April. There you go. <laughs> well, you should make one video talking about it. We that will. Way people can uh, click on it. But uh, make sure you slap Oh yeah, no, it, we'll make a video before it's parked in the garage. There you, you know, go. Right now it's still sitting outside, but 
once he goes into the garage. We'll make a video before it goes in the garage and talk about the car and just tell him that things will be coming. Oh yeah. Ready. Well guys, make sure you slap the like button down below, leave a comment, let us know what you think. Congrats to Rick here, and we'll see you guys in the next one. The car just went 10-7 at 127.